Welcome to Sacrilegious Discourse. I'm husband. And I'm wife. Together we're reading the Bible for the very first time. We grew up without religion and wanted to know what all the fuss was about. Well, what have we learned so far? That God is a dick, and apparently some people believe in talking donkeys? We're not trying to pass ourselves off as experts. Nope, we're just reading the Bible for the first time and giving our first take reaction. If you'd like to join us in this venture, you might consider starting at episode one. Otherwise, jump in wherever you like. All right, let's go read the Bible. Yeah, let's get to it. Husband! Wife! Do you remember what happened yesterday and where the hell we are and what the fuck is going on? Well, we just got done reading Isaiah chapter 33. We did. And in there, there was a ship that was not sailing or something. I don't, I don't know. Something like that. Yeah, there was there was God and he was saying stuff and Isaiah was saying it for him and... And there was people dying and people living, and, and God was causing most of it. And, and verses were out of order. He's always a dick, so there's that. Yes. Yeah, that was, I mean, I don't know. Isaiah is, it's just like a lot of doom and gloom. Mm-hmm. You know, like there's a lot of um, bad shit he's prophesizing. And then if you are fearful enough of God, that you might get to live after some shittiness. And yeah, that's about the gist of Pretty much every chapter we've read recently, it yeah, seems he like. Yeah, sucks. Yeah. So, anyway, that was Isaiah chapter 33. Not a fan. Sure I mean, you know, you're right, yeah. And so today we're reading... Isaiah chapter 34. All right, let's go do this. Okie dokie. All right, Isaiah chapter 34. All right. Very excited to... Jump into this chapter today. <laughs> come here. Come come here. You nations. Get over here. Get over here. <laughs> you nations and listen. Okay. Pay attention, you peoples. Mm. I'm going to I'm going to say that from now Pay on. Pay attention, you peoples. Pay attention, you peoples. Yeah. I need That'll that on get the shirt. Attention. Yeah. 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 Let the earth hear and all that is in it, the world and all that comes out of it. What okay, what are we world? supposed to what are we supposed to hear? We're coming but, over. But wait, but What's wait. What comes out of the world? Volcanoes? Spaceships. Those come off of the world, not from in the world. Like in the world. It doesn't say comes out. Oh. Okay, yeah, you're right. Okay. <laughs> come off the world versus out of the world. Okay. Right, yeah. That's fair. That's what I'm saying. The Lord is angry with all nations. Okay? All of them. He's okay. pissed. All right. His wrath is on all their armies. All of them. All of them. Across the board. Okay. No exceptions. 100%. Including the Native Americans? All of you suck. That's what he's saying. I'm just checking. Sure. Because, you know. People he's never met. Yeah. All of you suck. Right. Because you either suck because I know you or you suck because I don't know you. Right. 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 Yep. He will totally destroy them. He will give them over to slaughter. Boom. You know how it goes. Wow. Yeah. I'm pissed... You okay. know how I like to kill people, and I've decided, like, okay, I can't do a flood. What else is on the table? You, you know? know what really what really bothers me is that if some disaster happened in the world, right, and lots of people died, mm-hmm. there would be a significant amount of people that would be like, That's God's angry. That's what happens. God's mad. What you gonna do? They they were doing this over there, so that's why they they all died. That, that's always, what happened. It's all, oh, right now it's the trans people. Right. Like, 20 years ago, it was the gays. Now it's the trans. You know how it goes. God's always it's pissed just, at somebody. It's, it's like they, they don't like to recognize how angry God is at things until something bad happens. And then when something shitty happens, they're like, that was God. Shouldn't have had two legs and two feet. But if you talk to him on any regular Tuesday, God's a really mad. good, he's, he's a good guy. Beautiful. Yeah, he's a wonderful guy. He's, he's so loving. But he's when bad kind. shit happens, I mean, yeah. he did that because he was angry. Yeah. That's, you know, that's just God. You know, they're like, you know God. You know how God's angry? He did that. Oh, God's never angry. Like, <laughs> whoa! The whiplash is real. Yeah. All you gotta yeah. do is ask for forgiveness. Yeah. That's yeah. all. You that's just all have to do. fear him and right. roll around on the ground they don't in even, the dirt. They don't even use fear anymore. They just yeah. say forgiveness. Just they just forgiveness. ask for forgiveness, right? But mean it. But, but you, only right, kind you gotta, of. Right. At least on Sunday, mean it. And, I mean, it's fine if you hold the Bible upside down and <laughs> if you don't actually read it and know how to talk right, yeah. about it. 
Like, that's fine. As long as other people think that you're religious, then you're still probably okay. And really, do they have to think you're religious, or do they just have to like your warmongering? Yeah, that works too, I think. we love to kill. If you're godlike and want to kill other people, then you're yeah. pretty much Christian, so, right. you know, might yeah. as well just adopt you. Murder is fun. I mean, look, it's in the Bible. Slaughter! <laughs> Sorry, that was a lot of vague references to Trump there. But oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I just Trump, thought I'd throw that out, so. <laughs> that, was, that, that was definitely Trump we were describing there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Did you? Okay, sorry. I have to interrupt this broadcast to... <laughs> but that's not what we already were doing? No, no. Okay. Yes. <laughs> well, before it was like related. This is only related in that, oh, I have a thing to say about Trump. Ah, okay. okay. Yeah. So did you hear he went on Hannity and Hannity was trying to give him an out and be like, oh, the press is beating you up saying you're going to totally be an authoritarian, but you're not, right? And he was, like, totally, like, saying, here's a softball. Yeah. All you have to do is deny it. Right, Be yeah. like, I would never. He goes, literally, oh, I will on day one. Oh, my God. And then I'll stop. But i got to close those borders on day one. And uh, i got to take away health care on day one. Wow. Day one, I'll be an authoritarian. And then I'll stop. Wow. Well, i got to get all my people in place on day one. But then I'll <laughs> stop being. And so then Sean Hannity's like, okay. <laughs> and the conversation went on and then and then he came back to it because he was like, okay, we're going to try this again. <laughs> Why would you do that? And he was like, but you're not really going to be an authoritarian, right? 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 <laughs> and Trump was like, oh, no, I totally am. <laughs> <laughs> like, you could imagine Sean Hannity doing, like, the forehead on the desk move. Yeah. Like, oh, my God, you simpleton. Right. I was trying to help you. and But you- they've dug themselves a yeah, a, a, a hole. They can't. They can't. they can't. they just can't. Right. Like yeah. they have to go along with whatever the fuck he says at this point. Because no, like, just no. He wouldn't be an authoritarian, and now they're like, oh, authoritarian is awesome. Right. I love authoritarian. <laughs> we better start like, rewriting our scripts. Yeah, Jesus. Yeah. yeah. Like I, we were going to try to defend him and lie, but now we just there's no way out of it. Now right. we love authoritarians. I mean, fascism is so fun. <laughs> I mean, have you seen the Nazi outfits? They are so on fleet this year, <laughs> right? Okay, so anyway, yeah, yeah, back yeah. to the Bible, right? Mm, fun. Um, yeah. So slaughter. Yeah, slaughtering okay. everybody. Slaughter, yeah. yeah. Uh, you, you see the connection? Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. Their slain will be thrown out. As you do. Right. They're okay. dead bodies. <laughs> They're going to stink. They'll stink. Oh, my God. You know how that's... dead bodies stink? Wow. They will stink. That's that's very, dis- I mean, that's kind of disturbing that's in and the descriptive. Bible. Yep. Dead yeah. bodies stink. And, oh, also, mountains, <laughs> well, they will be soaked with their blood. Jesus. <laughs> I love me some blood. I'm God. I love blood. <laughs> you know? It's I'm imagining, fun. like, the amber waves of grain in our, like, national anthem. The amber, only, right? Only, like, it's the blood-soaked hills of Colorado. You yeah. Know? yeah. <laughs> All the stars in the sky will be dissolved. Jesus. Yeah. Like, I'm so wow. done with this creation that I am He's, he's just, blotting out everything. Like... <laughs> And and acid for you, and He's acid for you. Shaking the etch sketch. And throw some lie on this. Right? And, yeah. 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 All the stars in the sky will be dissolved, and the heavens rolled up like a scroll. I'm done with the heavens too. Fuck Man, this heavens. is like this is way this is gonna be way worse than the flood. He's yeah. like he's like it's all gone, guys. Y'all didn't want to flood. That's okay. I'm not gonna flood you. Don't worry. Right. I'm just gonna you know make you a zero existence. Right. Yeah. yeah. And the heavens too. Fuck those angels. But like, what does it even matter that you're killing them? Like you're gonna apparently wipe everything out. Right. So. Like you could just skip the kill and go straight to like some zero reset. Yep. Hitting the reset just button. Just hit here. the reset button. Yep. Whatever. All the starry host will fall like withered leaves from the vine. Mm. Killing the angels. Done with them. Okay. That's yeah. what the starry host is. All right. Okay. Yep. Like shriveled figs from the fig tree. Fuck those guys. Fuck mm. you. Fuck these. Fuck those. Fuck them. Yeah. Right. Fuck all the things. Mm-hmm. My sword has drunk its fill in the heavens. I'm so fucking done. Wow. Yeah. See, it descends in judgment on Edom. Okay. So now he's done oh. talking about. The whole um, world. The entirety of everything and always. Got it. And now he's like, specifically, You guys Edom. down there in Edom, you're, yeah. you're fucked. Yeah. Like, I was pissed at everything, but I turned around and you guys were in my sight. So, oh, you know what? Speaking of Edom. <laughs> right. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Them guys. The people I have totally destroyed. And Edom's like, 
You were just talking about everybody. Like, why? What, not, what, what did we? Why? We're literally no worse than anybody. You said else. everybody was bad. Why? Why are you focused on us, man? Why you gotta call us out? Okay, the people I have totally destroyed. Okay, oh, so he's, he did. He's done with he did them. it. He's done. The sword of the Lord is bathed in blood. It is covered mm. with fat, the blood of lambs and goats, fat from the kidneys of rams. Okay. He okay. is so murdery. He's like he's killing the animals. He's like bitches. I am covered in blood. But he, but why was I he killing it. animals? Because I am gluttonous. He's with just murder. like I want things to bleed. Is that basically? I all? cannot get enough slaughter and blood and murder. I'm so smiling angry. Right. I'm smiling. You think I'm angry, but I'm smiling. I'm literally a lunatic. I, I think that that's right? yeah that makes that makes more sense. For the Lord has a sacrifice in Basra and a great slaughter in the land of Edom. You know how be. Ah oh, yeah. And the wild oxen will fall with them. The bull calves and the great bulls. Their land will be drenched with blood. Awesome. Okay. We, we go swim in it, and the dust will be soaked with fat. I'm a little confused. I'm I'm, I'm actually I'm, really confused here. I'm killing all the animals too. Right, but like, but he's not okay, but. Like, why are we talking? I don't understand why we're talking about killing I'm, the animals. I'm killing everything. I'm also killing right. the angels. But like, if, if I'm killing the angels, you better guarantee I'm killing the animals. But why are we? We're so specif- specific about what we're killing here. We're going down to the specific animals. When he's talking about taking away the goddamn stars. Okay, listen to me. If I am killing the angels, do you think a caterpillar has a fucking chance? I mean, probably not. No. no yeah. Absolutely not. Platypus, gone. Yeah. I'm so yeah. over the platypus. If I'm killing my angels, my guys who worship me, I am definitely getting rid of the scorpion. I'm gonna I'm gonna hedge a hedge a guess here and and, and say that this hasn't happened. Doesn't because it if it if it like did, it. it feels like there'd be a lot of I mean you know what is that word? Extinction level event. Right. right? Yeah. <laughs> I feel like we would have had one of those and we didn't. It I, yeah. Right. right. Well, I mean, the the stars going away would probably make some news even thousands of years later. Yeah, I I would so. think that, and also all the rivers of blood and animal. Yeah, fat, yeah, that would definitely thing. that would that would uh, I happened, resonate. Yeah, I happened to see some documentaries today that had animals in them. Yeah, so they're, they're still around. Right. So. Right. So they made it. That's good. I'm Just glad to hear it. I'm glad to hear it. I haven't seen any angels lately, though. So, I mean, for all I know, they done. Right. Okay. Yeah. Have that, you? That, maybe that's maybe he stopped with the angels. It's like he started and then he killed all the angels. He was like, I was going to kill everybody else, but God damn, I'm tired. This, this shit wore me out. Right. Yeah. And I'm done being mad now. Whatever. Right. <laughs> I mean, whatever. <laughs> Like, literally, he just needs some, like, Lexapro or something. Pro- I mean, it sounds like it, yeah. I say that as a person on Lexapro. Right, right. <laughs> Not making fun and mocking people with mental health issues who need Lexapro. Right, right. So much as saying, me thinks the Lord could use some. Right. For the Lord has a day of vengeance, a year of retribution, to uphold Zion's cause. Okay. Oh, Okay. You know. We're upholding their, this is upholding their cause. Yeah, this is a what, cause. What exactly is their cause? Kill them all. Kill. Um, okay. Murder, murder, kill, I, kill. I think, I, okay, sure. Slaughter. I thought it was to fear God and to be upright and all that Drown shit. Drown in blood. But apparently it's just killing things. Dance in fat. Yeah, right. What? All those things apparently. Throw babies against rocks. <laughs> what? They, they haven't covered that one yet. Not not no. in this chapter. Not in this chapter. Right. I, I was just... Coming out ahead yeah, of it. Yeah, just right. I if, if I say it in comedy and jest ahead of it, then it won't be as disturbing to me maybe later <sighs> if it happens. Right. I'm trying to be dark funny because this is literally so twisted I can't. Yeah, right. Edom streams will be turned into pitch, like tar. Okay, all right. Her dust into burning sulfur. Her land will become blazing pitch. Hmm. You used that word twice. Right, yeah. Can't take you seriously. Yeah. It will not be quenched night or day. Its smoke will rise forever. Wow. They have a different so understanding this, of the word forever than I do, but that's okay. Right. It almost sounds like he's going to turn, I guess this is Edom he's talking about at this point, mm-hmm. but it almost sounds like he, they're talking about turning it into like Gehenna or something like mm-hmm. that, right? Like right. Like the, the tar pits, the flaming but pits. But guess what didn't happen? That. That. <laughs> exactly. 
From generation to generation, it will lie desolate. No one will ever pass through it again. Hmm. Mm-mm. Pick me. False. Right. False. Correct. The ooh. Okay, I have to say something about this next line. Ready? Sure. Yeah. The desert owl and screech owl will possess it. The great owl and the raven will nest there. Okay. Do you recall any references to desert owl, screech owl, great owl? Like the owls? No. No? Not off the top of my head. Okay. So I'm going to recommend that you and everybody else go give another listen to our Lilith episode. Okay. Because Lilith is another word for great owl and screech owl. Oh. And desert owl. Okay. Okay. So this could, so it could be like a alluding to that demons are, mm-hmm. are, are, Occupying the desert, Mm -hmm. that area? Yes. Interesting. Could be owls, could be demons, could be Lilith herself, who fucking knows. Okay. Could you, could you know? No, yeah, no, I I have no idea. It could literally be owls. Got it. But that is the same word that is used when we looked up Lilith. I see. That was... What was used. Interesting. And then we made a note then that, oh, okay, so when they talk about owls in that thing way far in the future, I think Isaiah or some shit. Right. We need to remember that. Okay, so now I'm I'm cashing it. in that, that chip. Got it. And saying, this is that. Okay. Okay. Right. Yeah. Okay. God will stretch out over Edom the measuring line of chaos and the plumb line of desolation. <laughs> chaos, desolation. <laughs> right. Fires. Yeah. Hell, bad, Lilith, bad shit. demons, whatever. It sucks. Her nobles will have nothing there to be called a kingdom. All her, oh, an ad just happened. That's, I hate it oh when ads happen. Oh my God. Ad should not what happen. What the fuck? I don't know. Oh, this ad like popped up and literally like it scrolled. Yeah. Okay, sorry. Okay, I'm back. Uh-huh. Here we go. Okay. Right. Her nobles will have nothing there to be called a kingdom. All her princes will vanish away. Mm. You know, as they do. Just vanish. Okay. What's really funny is that with regard to princes and royalty and stuff, um, my mom and I both agree that um, when we watch Hallmark movies every year Mm -hmm. for Christmas, that if it has princes or royalty in the title, we will absolutely not watch them. Ah, I see. (laughs) Not interested. My imagination only stretches so far. (laughs) No woman in America is going to be romanced and, and caught somewhere with some prince. Then, Are you sure about that? Okay. It happened to Meghan Markle, <laughs> but the rest of us, no. To be fair, she was a Hollywood actress. Right. But you said so, no woman in America. So I just had to, I meant, you know, like stipulate that that did actually happen. Okay. And you are right. That is a fair argument to make. However, she is gorgeous and she was an actress in Hollywood. One might claim that she was part of royalty herself. Okay. She certainly, as a beautiful actress in Hollywood in the show Suits, mm-hmm. was not a normal person. Right. Okay. Right. She certainly was not like in some small town USA. Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. So that's what I meant. But you make a fair point. Right. It'll never happen again. Right. Unless she is some other royalty. Got it. Okay. Mm-hmm. Thorns will overrun her citadels, nettles and brambles, her strongholds. She will become a haunt for jackals, a home for owls. I see. Or demons. But we've gotten away from destroying everything. Now we're haunting it. Right. <laughs> Just eat them. Mm, yeah. Apparently. Sure. Desert creatures will meet with hyenas and oh. wild goats will bleat with each other mm. and to each other. Okay. okay. You know who else bleats? Um, who? Trump. Uh- According to John Adarola of the Damage Report, he always refers to Trump as bleeding. Yes. When he is like tweeting or truthing or Xing or whatever the fuck he's doing on any given day. Right. Um, yes, he does. Mm-hmm. I do find it interesting though that they're mentioning goats and, mm-hmm. and also we're talking about Lilith goat. and possible mm-hmm. demons and yeah, stuff. Yeah. And then the fires and the tars and like yeah. it's very hellish. Very hellish. Yeah. yeah. There the night creatures will also lie down and find for themselves places of rest. Okay. The owl will nest there and lay eggs. She will hatch them and care for her young under the shadow of her wings. There also 
the falcons will gather each with its mate. Okay. Look in the scroll of the Lord and read. None of these will be missing. Not one will lack her mate. <laughs> okay. I don't know. Like, like what? Like what the I fuck is like, that supposed to mean? I felt like it was supposed to be like scary and gothic and dark. Yeah, so I was trying to give it that it twisted just... reading, but the words didn't match the voice. No. The birds. They're gonna. They're gonna. Birds laid eggs. Wee! Yeah. And I'm all the birds <laughs> laid eggs. Yeah, that didn't match. But no, that's not my not. fault. I can only go with what I'm given. I did not read it in advance. Yeah. I took notes and I could not know that we you were going to You just thought it was pretty. going there. And then, and then there's it's like, they're it, it all going to, those those things, they're all going to be there. Yep. And they're going to have mates. And and lay eggs. And lay eggs. Yeah. Now see, it could have been, it could have been like, and they're going to be those kind of birds that lay the eggs in the nests of other birds so that when those babies come out of their nest then then they eat the birds you know like it could have been like that but it wasn't right right what are those called i don't know god damn what it what you're talking about what are yes you do i'm sure those I, I must fucking, yeah those fucking birds they lay their eggs in the nests of other birds and okay. so they make the peaceful bird are those robins or are I they don't, starlings don't or what uh, there's yeah. a word for it and okay. I want to say it like starts with a D. It's like a dickhead. Yeah, basically. <laughs> but like the the sweet, unassuming bird is like, well, I thought I laid four, but here's a fifth. Okay. Uh, and then she just like, la la la. I guess I have five baby eggs now. And so right. she like nurses them or whatever you do with fucking eggs. You sit on them and hatch them, right? Yeah. And then so she's like, I have five babies and they all hatch. And then the one doesn't fit in and it ain't an ugly duckling mm. it's a i'm gonna kill you and eat you and take this nest got it got yeah it, yeah i don't know what they're called i forgot okay well okay. it is what it is well see that would have been more fitting see how i just took a thing that actually happens and was like that could be a bible story right right i wrote the bible better mm. just saying yeah just yeah. saying okay for it is his mouth that has given the order and his spirit will gather them there he allots their portions. His hand distributes them by measure. They will possess it forever and dwell there from generation to generation. The end. Okay. okay. So I, I'm the the ending with the birds really yeah. is throwing me off here a bit. Yeah. What's up with the fucking birds? I, I feel I like we know. just got done watching Twin Peaks. Right? <laughs> yeah, kind of. And for like, those who don't know. Log lady you or should, something? Like, the, it turns into like, there's owls. Yeah. Remember the owls? I do. Yeah. Remember the owls. <laughs> yeah, I do. I do remember the owls. I just, that was, what's up with the fucking birds? Okay, hold on. Well, I mean, are we, there, are we, are we going to get into that in the Q&A or do you have something to say I, now? I don't know. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm seeing what those, cuckoos. That's oh, you called. just had to find. That, I had that. to find it. Yeah. They are called brood parasites. They're cuckoos. Okay. They don't raise their own young. I see. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. So that happened. But we should look into what's up with the fucking birds in the Q&A. And the cuckoos. Well, that wasn't in the Bible. But it so. should have been. <laughs> like, my story about the bo- the cuckoo birds was way better. Yeah. But, but it wasn't that Also, great. it's really odd that the, that chapter ended with just fucking birds. If like, happy that's little weird. bluebirds fly above Gehenna, why, oh, why can't I... Jesus I want to I want to fly over hell <laughs> like the happy little bluebirds. All right. So on that note, that mm-hmm. was Isaiah chapter 34. It sure as fuck was. And we will be back tomorrow with Wait, hold on. What is hold tomorrow? On. Um okay, so this is going out on Friday. Oh yeah, so, so tomorrow. So that would make tomorrow Q&A Saturday. <laughs> <laughs> you, you fucked that up. I sure as fuck did. Should All I try right. it again? Do it again. Yeah. Q&A sure. Saturday. All right. And then on Sunday this week I think we're going to be doing um Sacrilegious Book Club. And then I'll get the weekly wrap out up and then we'll be back on Monday with I see you chapter 35. All right. We'll see you guys then. Bye. Hey, wife, I guess that's the end. But husband, that's just sad. It doesn't have to be. We are on lots of social media platforms like Twitter. Our handle there is sacrilegious underscore D. For D's nuts. Oh my God. 
Stop doing that. Anyway, we're also on Facebook, Instagram, and Pinterest. There's a link to all of our social media sites at our website. Oh, we have a website? Yeah, it's sacrilegiousdiscourse.com, where you can also find a link to our merch shop. We have a merch shop? Yep. We have podcast-themed clothing, mugs, notebooks, and more, as well as an atheist and science-themed products. Wow, our fans should really go check that out right now. Definitely. They can get in touch with us by sending an email to sacrilegiousdiscourse at gmail.com. But before they do that, we could really use some help. Oh, yeah? With what? Well, it's not free running the podcast, and we need some financial support in order to get better equipment, which will free up time so we can concentrate on our podcast and our fans. Okay, so what should they do? Head over to patreon.com forward slash sacrilegious discourse and sign up as a contributor on our podcast. Supporters there receive additional bi-weekly episodes that we record just for our Patreon members for as little as $2 a month. Also, we'd really appreciate it if you would like and subscribe on whatever platform you're using. And Apple Podcast Reviews help us out tremendously. Like and subscribe. Leave an Apple review. Join us on Twitter. Support us on Patreon. That's a lot of instructions. Don't forget to say thanks. Thanks. Okay, bye. <laughs>